Hey everyone, Keith here, Tips and Tricks HQ. In this quick video, I'm going to uh, demonstrate the use of the 404 detection feature of the WP Security plugin by Tips and Tricks. Now, first of all, you want to get that plugin installed. And you can find it in the WordPress plugin repository. It's called the All in One WP Security plugin. All right, and once that's installed, you click on the WP Security menu, click on Firewall. And then right at the end, click on the 404 detection tab. Now, to enable it, you just have to check this box. And essentially what it'll do is start logging any 404s that happen. And what it's looking for is 404s that occur frequently by the same visitor. And that would suggest that they're trying to guess at URLs that don't exist in order to find something, you know, um, probably for malicious intent. So you could put the checkbox on to turn that feature on and then you can lock them out. <clears throat> Excuse me, you can lock them out for any length of time. You just put the time in there in minutes. So by default, it's an hour. So that person will assume they're locked out for good because they're gonna try for a few minutes, probably not come back um, if they're there for any reason uh, that wasn't legit. So then once you, so by default, it's 60 minutes and by default, they're gonna redirect to this URL. You could put any URL in there, so when they are locked out, they'll just redirect to this page instead of being able to visit your website. So you can just click on Save Settings there. And since it's logging, I'm gonna go ahead and log a, a 404. So I'm just gonna go to the website here. I'm gonna type in a URL that I know doesn't exist. Okay, so the not found error. So that's the 404 which got triggered. Now this plugin should detect that error and log it. There it is there with my IP. And this is the URL that I attempted to visit and the time. So I can I have the option here, I can temporarily block this IP address, which I'm not gonna do because that's me, but I have the option to temporarily block it. All right, so that's, that's really all there is to this feature. Um, again, this is Keith Lock, Tips and Tricks HQ. Thanks for watching.